Well, good day and thank you for tuning in. I trust that you will have a wonderful day today. I would like to encourage you out of God's word and in the book of Jeremiah 23 verse 29, we read that where the prophet declares, Is not my word like a fire declares the Lord and like a hammer that breaks the rock into pieces? And so I would like us to just quickly stand still where it says that is not my word like a fire. Think about a fire. What does a fire do? It brings warmth. Um, it brings light. And um, also it, it brings energy. It brings um, inspiration. And so God's word is exactly like that. God's word brings light. It brings warmth. Also, it brings inspiration. Isn't that what we all need? Specifically, maybe today. We all need some inspiration. We all need some light. We all need some energy. And we all need some inspiration. Get into God's word. And then the second part of that verse is where the prophet likens the word of God to a hammer. Well, that's exactly what God's word does when we allow it to break through those hardened places in our lives. And maybe there are some parts in your life that you haven't surrendered unto God yet. Allow God's word to dwell richly inside of you today, just like Colossians 3 verse 16 says. And so when you allow God's word to dwell richly inside of you, I can guarantee you the words that will come out of your mouth today will be words of life, will be words of inspiration, will be words that brings warmth. It will be words that bring light into a dark, a dark situation. So let us just close our eyes and pray together. Father God, thank you for your word. Thank you that it brings light. Thank you that it brings inspiration. Thank you that it brings warmth. And thank you that it brings a breakthrough. Thank you, Lord, that your word dwells richly inside of us. And when it does, Lord, I say thank you that today we will speak your word, Lord, that we will bring light, that we will bring warmth, that we will bring inspiration, that we will bring breakthrough around us because of your word that's dwelling richly inside of us. I pray this in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Well, thank you for tuning in and may you have a blessed day in Jesus' name. Amen.